what a great movie. I I hope that you saw the film in 3D, yes? Oh, yes. yes. And it yeah. seems real, right? Yes. Um, as, I, as I was watching this film last night, I was thinking, oh, man, this is a terrible way to die because of, you know, the heat. Yes. And um, I don't know any other place beside Pompeii would have this sort of mm, dangerous uh, natural disaster did you, uh, are you actually, aware in, anywhere else? Yes. Um, uh, in fact, there are many volcanoes like Vesuvius that are capable of unleashing, and they have done, this type of volcanic eruption. Uh, you know, for example, Krakatau in Indonesia, Tam oh. Tambor in Indonesia. Uh, this volcano in Indonesia is erupting now, it had pyroclastic flows and actually killed a few people. I heard about it today. Oh. Uh, Mount St. Helens in 1980 was a similar type of uh, uh, of eruption. Uh, what made the 79 AG uh, eruption, I think, so important uh, was, first of all, it preserved the city of Pompeii uh, for archaeologists later on, but also because of these uh, plaster casts mm. of the barges. Uh, so that, that really give us this idea of how they died, and they died of heat shock, right. and very, very nasty death. Very nasty death, very quick death, right? Would you say quick or uh, not uh, too quick when it, it comes to? Uh, it, they, they died of heat shock, and uh, uh, I, I cannot tell you in terms of how many seconds, right, right. Uh, I mean, but it, it's not instant. Right. Uh, so it, it would have been very painful. So now here in the States, uh, are there any states around the country that we should be aware of? these sort of f future disaster ever happens? Oh, oh yes. Because uh, uh, you know, California, uh, we have earthquake, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, you know, uh, absolutely. There, um, uh, you can have eruptions with pyroclastic flows, and in fact, you do. Uh, uh, in 1902, a uh, uh, volcano in Martinique uh, killed nearly 30,000 people with very much the same type of eruption. But uh, it, it really shows that the uh, er eruption of Vesuvius that destroyed Pompeii is just so much more famous than uh, so many others. Right. I mean, mm -hmm. not only volcano, it was uh, mm -hmm. at the time earthquake and tsunami. What caused all those three disasters to happen at the same time? Do you uh, know? As magma is moving up, it causes earthquakes. So, uh, in fact, there were a lot of earthquakes with a lot of warning yes. uh, for uh, uh, the Pompeians. And, and in fact, many of them left uh, before the main pyroclastic flows uh, reached the city. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. Do you have any thought to, to this? Uh, well, it, uh, and I'm an archaeologist, so I, I come at this material from an archaeological angle. Um, and what we really, you know, in terms of excavating this city, trying to reconstruct what life was like yes. for these people, what their final days yes. were like, that the sequence of events, um, and we, we learn a lot from the geology uh, that we find, um, and of course the level of destruction uh, that we witness it is, is far more than just time. Uh, right. You know, a lot of the buildings collapsed from the weight of the falling rocks and ash. Uh, roof tiles are one thing that you find everywhere uh, mm. because the roofs collapsed. Fires, um, because of course everything's lit by oil lamps. So the fires um, we know were raging through the city. Did you find any uh, couples that were still holding on to each other after? Um, that that um, perhaps was, was maybe more for dramatic effect, <laughs> although we do find um, some of the most evocative casts are the ones with parents holding their children. Oh, yeah, that's so sad. Yeah. Thank you so much for talking to us. Thank you. Thank you.